Joining me now is the 2023 Superior Livestock top rep, Will Yeager. First of all, congratulations, Will. Last night was really just a culmination of all your hard work, you know, coming to the year end. What did it feel like to be up there and be recognized for all your hard work and efforts? Uh, didn't feel real. Uh, you know, just it's a it's a touching moment to be able to uh, have it all just kind of come together like that. It's pretty cool, you know. Uh, wouldn't be here for my dad. Uh, so getting to do this with him, it means a lot to me. Well, you know, I, I know that your dad has played, you know, a really important role in, in you getting into this business, and I'm, I'm sure you've learned so much from him. What are some of the things that he's taught you that you apply in what you do as a rep? Uh, honesty and integrity. Uh, you call a man, you tell him what you're going to do, you do it. And uh, you tell a seller or, or, and what you're going to do or what you can do, and you try to stand by that. And that's the biggest thing he's taught me is just, you know, if you're going to if you're going to tell somebody uh, – something you need to back it up so well speaking out so we've we're at a new year here so you've 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 knocked out 2023 you've done a great job there what are we looking forward to in 2024 uh i'm gonna put it in neutral <laughs> i don't want to i don't want it to go that hard no more so i'm i'm hoping to have another good year in the front and the forecast but uh i want to be home more with my boy uh hang out with my wife so whew, uh it's tough. Yeah. I don't. I don't know. I mean, I guess. I guess I could do it, but I don't. Thinking about it already got me bothered. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know. So your dad was there. Your whole family was there, and Grayson was, you know, on stage running around. How soon do you think it's going to be before we see him either helping you ship cattle, deliver cattle, or repping cattle? <sighs> he can dang sure talk about it. So he uh, he's got that part down. No, I really hope. I hope he uh, comes in, comes along like I did. You know, that's what. My dad set this, set the, gave me the keys to the kingdom, to kind of keep going. And one day, I hope Grayson wants to do that with me. So, it'd be cool to see. Absolutely. Well, earlier this uh, this year, I know you told me how many states you've been in. I can't remember what the number was. So, all of those customers across all those states, you know, what does it mean to have all those people to trust you to rep their cattle and handle their business for them? Uh, it uh, it means a lot. Uh. You know, I got a couple guys, they live 1,100 miles from me, and they're best friends. We talk every day, and it's it's pretty crazy to think that you could uh, have that trust with somebody from that far away. Uh, but communication's key, and uh, the biggest thing about communication is doing, like I said, doing what you say. You know, I, t I told these guys, and they, I taught them, kind of showed them the roadway, and they trust, they trust me, and so we're going to just continue to do that. Well, I know you have definitely grown up in this business like so many other people, especially in the superior business. So I have to ask you, what is one of your favorite memories as a kid being being around um, in this whole industry? My favorite memory is I was in Steamboat. I was about 12 years old, and uh, my dad thought it was going to be real funny. Bill Brody's daughter was at the pool. And I told my dad I seen a good-looking girl at the pool, and dad, or not Bill Barrett, and dad found out it was Barrett Brody, and so he told Barrett about it. And Barrett's a pretty big old boy, and Barrett come and bowed up on me and said, "You looking at my daughter at the pool?" And I said, "No, sir, not at all. I was scared to death." And so <laughs> that's probably one of my favorite memories. <laughs> Well, a good time here. Once again, congratulations. You, you've definitely deserved it because you, you've, you've definitely worked very hard. appreciate you being on here with me this morning. Don't go anywhere. We've got more Superior Sunrise up next.